Can you believe, seriously, can you believe that it's been 20 years? No, I can't. It seems like yesterday. And sure. think about the guys. Yeah. Okay, so this was back then. You had Sam Bush, the, Sam Bush 20 years ago, mm -hmm. Greg Martin, the Headhunters. You, you know, they were really in their prime. I mean, just like oh, really gosh, making yes. it big. So, and think how their career, and you've got Byron House, oh, who Byron, plays yeah. with Led Zeppelin and the Band of Joy. Sure. I mean, these are all your buds. Mm -hmm. And now look at the beautiful careers that they've oh, had over the years. But just... they always come back. Oh, yes. They're, wow. they're hometown boys. We gave the, the proceeds from our first benefit concert to VH1 Save Music and realized real quickly that it, we didn't see any effects of that money in our Locally, area. Locally, yeah. So that's when we decided to start our own concert, the Jambodian Bash, and all the money stays in Warren and the, the surrounding counties too. Long. And uh, it's our 20th year, or a big anniversary this year. Okay, so S O N R H E A, yeah, right. got it. And proceeds go to benefit schools in this area. Mm -hmm. So. And I have seen where you have gone into the schools to to uh, shower the children with the proceeds mm -hmm. from this amazing event. So tell me what that's like when oh. you see a child get that musical instrument. I, I, I think uh, one of the things that, that touched my heart is I get uh, construction paper uh, cards Thank you notes. Yeah. written in crayon by oh. a lot of these students. And that just it just touches me because you know it's amazing how how little it what it takes how little it takes to influence a child in a positive way if you could just give them something that they have I mean there's so many kids that, that could be the best athlete or could be you know valedictorian or whatever but right. the majority of the kids don't really have a direction or a purpose and everybody needs a direction and a purpose and you need to you need to feel like you fit in somewhere mm -hmm. and i think that i think that's one of the things that i hope that we're giving kids for sure because music did that for you oh, right definitely, definitely. yeah so you said it's amazing how little it takes and yet how much it takes because a lot of these schools can't afford musical instruments right. unfortunately the arts and music have right. fallen down and um so it, for a family, it might take everything to be able to afford a saxophone right. for their son, but you can do this through the Sunray Foundation. Right. With with a lot of help from so many people. I mean, we have a board and uh, and so many other people that contribute. Um, Royal Music, which is now Music and Arts, Greg Lyons at Royal has been our kind of our partner all along the way. Greg not only sells us instruments at a very fair price, but they refurbish instruments also. Mm. So if people donate instruments that need repair, he does that for free. And, and he also, when someone calls me in need, I direct them to Greg. And as soon as he gets the order ready, he calls me and says, okay, here's how much it's gonna cost. And I go, go for it. So. Uh, All right, thank you so thank much. You, thank you. Tony Lindsay, this is Coffee Near Me. Hey, we're at Q Emporium. Your first time here, my first, first time here. Time. Really cool, right? Great Your coffee's place. still I'll hot. Be back. Thank, I'll be back. I'll be back. Thank you so much. You're watching Coffee Near Me. I'm Barbara Deed. Thank you. Easy peasy.